We all know that cable management is a pain in the ass, but what I'm gonna do today is show off a little tip that you can use to take some of those pesky cables and get them out of sight out of mind. For the demonstration, we're gonna pretend that this cheap piece of laminated wood is the underneath of your desk, and what we need to do is take this cable and route it right across so that it doesn't hang down. What we're gonna need is a staple gun. Now, I'm gonna link a couple down below that are super cheap, but most of you probably already have this. Next, you're gonna need some tie wraps, another thing that most people already have, and if you don't, they are super, super, super cheap. So I'm gonna take this cable and I'm actually gonna double it up so it looks like there's two cables here, like so. What we wanna do is take this cable and run it straight across the desk so it's not dangling down and looking terrible. So I'm putting some staples in here and this is what we're gonna to use to route the cables. So there we go. I put three really, really small staples in there. As you can see, there's just a little bit of a hole there. Now, the reason why I want the staples that small is because all we're gonna do is put tie wraps through them. So it's very skinny. We don't need anything too crazy, but if you wanted to, you can get bigger loops and with that, just feed the cables through the staple itself. Now, the reason why I'm using tie wraps is because what I want to do is be able to put tons of cables through here and it would have no problem at all. Obviously for this demonstration, I'm just taking one cable, wrapping it up twice and feeding it through. But if you wanted to, you could put a couple of cables through here and have no issues at all. So there we go. As you can see, we have all the holes that we need. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and take my cable or cables, take it like so and feed it through. So now my cables are in and that's really all I needed to do. So now that I have the cables where I want them, I'm gonna go ahead and put my hand down on the actual cable uh, it's a lot easier if you're doing it under your desk, but it's just easier for me to film like this. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take that closest tie wrap and tighten it. Now I'm not tightening all the way because with this I can still add more cables, but also I don't want it to be too hard for me to put a scissor through it later and just cut the tie wrap if I wanna undo what I'm doing. So now our cable is set and it's running through and you don't even see it unless you really, really look underneath. Now the last step would be to cut the excess of the tie wrap. Now it's good that we can just take the whole piece off because if we want to take it off later, we'll put it right through the hole and cut it off, which is why we're leaving it so loose. But another reason why it's good to leave it loose is because it does not need to be tight. As long as the cables are sitting there, they're not going to do anything and it's not really going to be a problem to you. So no reason to make it extremely tight and get it stuck on the wire. So there we go. That's what it's going to look like. Now again, I'll show you. What, how it would look underneath your desk, like so, but really the cables are there. Let's say you need to undo this because you wanna remove this cable and you don't want it set up like this anymore. Not a problem, just go ahead and cut the tie wraps off like so, make sure you don't cut the actual cable, that would be uh, kind of a bad thing to do. And there you go, you can remove your cable, you take your tie wraps out, and now you're left with these staples. Now this is one of the best parts about this because if you want, you can leave it. It's not a big deal. It's barely visible. I mean, you have to really, 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 really look for it. But if you do want to go ahead and take them out, they're not going to leave a lot of damage. Now this is cheap, very cheap laminate wood. So it does look a little more frightening than it would on a quality piece of desk. But once I remove all these, I'll show you how it looks. And all you're doing is taking a pair of pliers and you just pulling them right out, it's just a staple, nothing crazy. But looking from far away, you're not really seeing damage. Now, if I bring it a little bit closer, that's kind of what it would look like. Now, I said this was cheap laminate, so kind of get the idea there. Most desks won't look like this, but overall, this is underneath your desk. I don't think it makes a difference. Not a bad way to manage cables, and it's super easy to do. There you go, super easy to install, super easy to uninstall, and it's super cheap. Win, win, win. If you guys wanna see more videos like this, go ahead and write staple gun flamingo in the comment section down below. And with that said, I'll catch you on the flippity flop.